Good day everyone. Have you been experiencing delayed Windows boot up for your Windows system? Well, for today's video, I'm going to share with you how are you going to speed up your Windows system by upgrading from an old hard disk drive to a new SSD drive. So, let's check it out. Okay, so let's see how fast this PC boots up. It's already gone down but still on 100% so for this one we'll try to upgrade the hard disk and change it to a solid state drive <coughs> so we'll just compare it later so I think it's already more than 10 minutes and still it's already beginning to lower down the disk percentage it's now at only zero, so meaning it has finally loaded all the Windows operating system for our PC. Okay, so for this one, we'll check on manage and check on the device manager to see uh, what is the CPU for this one. So this is quite an old PC, it's, it's almost uh, more than five years, I think. So this is an old PC with an AMD Pro A10, 8750. Uh, four core, eight gigahertz performance. So still a good uh, processor, but we need to upgrade our disk. Okay. So also if you have the time to do maintenance on your PC, you might do it as well by using a blower to do a little maintenance. So it is important that you, you clean up what's inside the PC and this is full of dust and dirt. Okay. Ok, 
Okay, so for the hard disk, we'll be using the HIK Vision E100. So this is just a somewhat a cheap solid state drive here. So it's a 512 gigabit hard solid state drive from uh, Hick Vision. So, so this is now the hard drive. Hick Vision SSD E100. So it's a 512 gigabit uh, hard drive that we'll be using as a Windows boot up hard drive. And let's check on the performance later. Okay, so time to install the SSD. So this is just uh, same with the uh, SSD drive, uh, SSD hard drive. It has the same pin as this old hard drive. This one, so this is the old hard drive. So this is the new SSD. So it has the, the same pin here. So very easy to install. First, you can plug in the power supply. And the uh, SATA connector here. So now that it's secured, okay. just see it's properly connected to the motherboard and the power supply. And let's try to install Windows. need to download all the drivers for the motherboard and some other stuff okay so let's continue later
have successfully uh, upgraded of our uh, PC system from upgrading the old hard disk drive to the new SSD drive. So by just upgrading it to the new SSD drive, it certainly improves its performance. So that's it. So if, if you think this video is helpful for you, then just give it a like and share it with your friends. Till the next video.